Consider that you've listed your home on the market and are now receiving offers. Other than the purchase price, what should you look for in an offer? Hi, I'm Don Pelletier, I'm owner broker at the Don Pelletier Group. As a seller, getting an offer on your home can be really exciting, I know. But with your home likely your very largest asset, you want to get as much as possible from the sale. So here's a few essential things to consider with the offer. Number one, how is the buyer going to finance the purchase? Knowing how well the buyer is pre-approved and can show proof of funds of where the money is coming from is really important on the front end. Remember, while cash may appear king, it doesn't always give you the most negotiating power. So you really want to think about this and weigh both the pros and the cons between a mortgage and an all-cash transaction. How much money is the buyer putting down in good faith to secure their offer? That's an important question because usually a higher level, or I should say a higher amount of good faith deposit, it indicates the buyer is pretty serious about the purchase and they also understand the risk of losing that deposit. What contingencies are attached to the buyer's offer? The more contingencies a buyer places within their offer, the more chances that they have to walk away from the purchase and oftentimes you can't keep your deposit even if you've been inconvenienced. You may want to consider an offer with fewer contingencies and also very important. What does the closing timeline look like? You want to choose an offer with a closing date that's going to allow you enough time to complete your move stress-free even if you need additional days in the property after the closing. Finally, work with your trusted agent to be sure that you understand the contract so you can successfully close the transaction without any hiccups or misunderstandings or problems. Don Pelletier here. As always, please feel free to contact my team and I at 858-336-1114 with any questions you may have about selling your home, uh, prepping the house for sale, etc. We can always help you make the most informed decisions in today's market. Uh, we also have tons of resources. I mean, I've been through this process over 2,200 times with behalf of our clients. So we're completely set up for any, you know, uh, pre-market improvements that you need to make to your property. If you need a free assessment um, upfront, there's no, you know, cost or obligation on your part. You just want to get a sense of, well, what things would make sense to do ahead of selling your property so that you don't waste good money, put good money after bad, and something where if you spend a dollar, you get a five or 10 times return on that money. That turns it from being an expense of sale to actually being an investment in your property. So if I can help, feel free to reach out anytime. And for more information on myself or my company, uh, you can look online at donpelletier.com. Thank you.